outrage. They say it's mocking the death of George Floyd. Channel 11's Mike Holden is live at Winchester Thurston School in Shadyside where this happened. Mike, how else are students responding to this? Susan and David, these students I spoke with are furious. They say they are disgusted by this video and it is not a direct representation of them. Tonight, they are calling out school administrators saying they need to do more and they should not be sweeping the situation under the rug. Honestly, it's just disgusting, it's disturbing, it's uncomfortable. This video posted on Snapchat has caused outcry and anger among students at Winchester Thurston School. We are blurring their faces because of their ages. The video shows a male student with his knee on the back of a female student saying, Me. George. Thank you. Olivia Wright and her classmates say it is a blatant mockery of the death of George Floyd. I say I find it very shocking that the I can't breathe statement was made after George. The video was shot two weeks ago during a free period inside of the Shadyside School. Today, students were black as part of a protest to stand against the video and the administration. They believe leaders lack transparency and the incident was minimized. It makes me very disappointed. I have four adopted black brothers and as a white person I always say that it's not really my place to be angry. Channel 11 reached out to Winchester Thurston for comment. The head of school said he could not discuss student discipline saying quote we take all allegations seriously and investigate them according to our student handbook which includes interviews with involved students and their advisors. We have provided spaces for our students and employees of color to gather to acknowledge the incident and to offer our support. I really just hope that the school handles it in a mature way. Um, I think they have a history of doing a lot of talking and not a lot of action. And Winchester Thurston says their team of counselors are actually working directly on this issue. In the meantime, though, these students say a much larger conversation needs to happen. They want action, and they say they're planning much more in the future. Reporting live tonight in Shadyside, Mike Holden, Channel 11 News. All right, Mike.